Howdy friends. Welcome back to uh, the building of our homestead uh, for the chicken coop. I think I've decided it's probably gonna be a chicken palace build. Today we'll focus on putting up the uh, wire mesh on the windows and the tops. And I think if we work hard enough, we could probably get the siding up. Let's get started, come along. So on this coop, as you may have noticed, it's gonna be kind of an open um, design. A lot of the research I've done says that the open coops are kind of work a little bit better, especially because we live in a very warm climate. Um, rarely do we get freezing. And if we do have, you know, some freezing weather coming up, we can just put some tarps over the front. But we are going to do wire mesh along the top and the sides up in there. The research that I've been doing says that ventilation is key. Ventilate, ventilate, ventilate. And the more um, ventilation you have, the drier it's gonna be, and the healthier your chickens will be. I guess a, a moist, damp chicken area is not really very good. Uh, we are going to put uh, siding here just to keep any critters or anything that might wanna try and get in there. Give them a harder time. Um, and then also, the wall that we built extends a little bit past the entry and that's going to be to kind of help the wind from whipping in and around. Just wanted to give you an overview on why we're doing more of an open style instead of just a sealed in tight uh, type. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, let's cut some wire and uh, get that up. You gotta be careful when you're cutting the uh, this wire at an angle. Let's see if it'll focus. Those points are razor sharp. Needle sharp. It got me already. All right, finally, we get to the siding portion of the uh, chicken coop. I went with a concrete siding, four by eight sheet of uh, hardy board is what it's called around here, uh, grooved, it's cheaper that way for some reason. The advantages of running uh, concrete siding is it's not gonna rot like uh, wood siding. One disadvantage though, it doesn't have much shear value to it, so it's brittle, so it's not going to, it, if the building moves too much, it does have the chance of breaking. So when we move it, which it's going to be moved, I'm gonna have to take a couple precautions to make sure it doesn't break too easily. But like I said, it's not gonna rot, especially up against the elements that it's gonna have here with the chickens um, and their business and stuff inside there. But it's comparable to a wood siding in cost, but you got your advantages either way. So that's why I'm gonna do it. But first, let's prep the uh, wall for it to make it a little bit easier. It is extremely heavy, so uh, yeah. 
So I wanna have this siding hang down below the floor. So I made a mark below the flooring an inch and a half and I'm putting in this um, ledger board and it'll hold the siding. I'm doing this alone and that's really the easiest way to do it by yourself, even if you're using wood or, or other things like that. So I'll just put this on, put a screw on one side and then level that across. I guess another thing I should mention is it's really dusty. So got the siding on the sides and then the back. Before I finish up the back upper part, I wanted to show you what I got going on here. What I did is I had an old uh, above ground pool that was uh, holy, had, wasn't really doing much pooling. And I cut, cut a section off of it and put it over the uh, nesting boxes here. And then once I get the siding on, I'm also gonna do siding here uh, we'll put a piece of plywood over this and then with some hinges, but this should keep this area dried off and looking fresh. Pretty much all I did was just put some roofing nails in right there. Basically that's all it's doing. And then overlap my siding. Oh, it looks about three inches. And I'm not putting any nails down here because I want to keep the... Uh, unholy <laughs> uh, so yeah also on the side we'll put siding on that little section right there and then hopefully get some trim going down and it'll cover up that gap there but yeah that's what's going on in the back time to get back to putting siding on What does the chicken say? No. <laughs> what does the chicken say? Blah. Blah. You like the chicken house? Yeah. I love it. You love it? <laughs>